Hey everyone, my name is Crow and Happy New Year's everyone. Man, I actually love this holiday. Uh, a lot of people, you know, they love other holidays and it's not my favorite holiday. And actually it's not really considered a holiday to a lot of people. But I really love this holiday because people do these things called New Year's resolutions and they use these things to essentially inspire them to do better, to motivate them to do better. And some people bite off a little bit more than they can chew and they like, oh, well, my New Year's resolution is to do this, my New Year's resolution is to do this. And some people, you know, they don't actually end up doing it. But regardless of what your New Year's resolution is, I always say try to bite off more than you can chew. Try to set goals higher than you can think you can reach because if you stick in your safe zone you'll never be able to accomplish the things that you want to accomplish in life so set a, set your goals above the bar try to make things complicated if you're not afraid of your goals if you're not afraid of your dreams you're not setting yourself high enough like you're not giving yourself enough credit you really need to be like afraid of what you're trying to accomplish if you think it's impossible then that's probably a good thing because you want to try to achieve that. You want to try to surpass that. You want to get over that hill. If you know you can get to something, then you're not really accomplishing anything, are you? Because you know you can do it. Like, that's not an accomplishment at all. Like, I don't know. So always set your goals to be more than what you expect of yourself and then try to surprise yourself. You know what I'm saying? And the reason why I bring this up is because I've decided what I'm going to go ahead and do, since this particular holiday is a holiday of inspiration, I am going to impersonate three YouTubers that inspire me to make videos, or inspired me in the uh, past and such. Um, I just want to point out that these particular YouTubers are just YouTubers that I thought of that I really enjoy watching, and they're ones that uh, have inspired me, but that doesn't necessarily mean that... They are mo my most, you know, inspiring YouTubers to watch. It's just they're the funnest to impersonate, pretty much. So uh, let me know what you guys think about it. Hello, everybody. My name is Markiplier, and welcome to Let's Play Slenderman. I like to do this thing where I get really close to the microphone, and my voice gets all deep and subtle, and it just makes your panties want to drop. Speaking of panties, I don't wear pants. Also, I like boxes for some reason. I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye. Hi guys, Minx here. Hope you're all doing fucking well. I'm doing fucking great, thank you. Today, we're going to be playing a game that has a fantastic story, but I'm probably going to make a lot of poo jokes, so it's going to be really funny instead. Also, right quick, just want to point out that I am a lesbian, and uh, I'm never going to do face cam, so if you guys keep asking me to do it, I'm probably going to run a katana down your spine. So yeah, just, just stop that, okay? Oh, Alright? Okay. We have to find out who the number one German is. <laughs> Sliced into you like a pepperoni. Ah! Who the fuck killed me? Carrera. Shit! Back to me. Oh, shit. I missed him. Got him. Ah! Gotcha. Carrera. Gonna shoot my gear all over your welfare check, you little Nazi bastard. Ooh. Knee capped him. Oh, he didn't see me. He didn't see a damn thing. So sweet. And then you know that you're screwed when you see me in the trenches. Because I'm the trench lord. Shit! Shit! <sighs> Where are we? Let's get a recap here. <sighs> Career is in first place. My nemesis.
Well guys, that is my three YouTube impersonations. Like I said guys, it wasn't done in any specific order and it wasn't done in any um, like particular fashion as far as uh, YouTubers I look up to the most it was just the ones that I had the most fun recreating I did try my hand at a few other ones But I do want to know that there's a lot of youtubers out there that I really really enjoy and I love to watch that I couldn't do it on because I, I didn't know how to approach it and like how like what circumstances to go under to do it uh, if that makes any sense like um, Chilled Chaos and Ohm Wrecker are probably my two favorite youtubers so I, I get their humor you know that, that, that that's like my style of like humor the stuff that they do uh, so I wasn't able to actually do any impressions on them because I didn't know where to go with them uh, with Ohm Wrecker you know he's just he's very trolly and he's very like snake in the grass type you know just like chilled you know uh, but you know Ohm Wrecker doesn't use face cam and chilled well I can't do chill I mean no one can do chill <laughs> so uh, yeah uh, I wanted to do them but you know I can't yeah you know, I, I, I'm not capable of it but I hope you guys enjoyed this and you know I hope you guys are having a fantastic new year I hope that you guys make a good revelation for yourselves uh, something that you feel like you can you know put above yourself and give yourself higher standards than what you think you may deserve but anyways guys Thank you so very much for watching, guys. I'll be doing some more Undertale in the future. I know I haven't done that in a couple days, but that's because I've been feeling a little sick lately, but I'm feeling fine now, so expect that in the future. And until next time, guys, take it easy.